Hey guys and welcome back. So this video is all about fixing the issue. Device driver software was not successfully installed while installing a device driver for your hard disk, your Bluetooth device or any audio or video device. So let's go ahead and proceed. Let's start with the basic troubleshooting steps. Head over to your settings menu. In settings menu, you need to choose the windows update option. Scroll down and click on the advanced options over here. Now click on the option optional updates. Here you need to click on the option driver update and if any driver update are present over here, simply check mark both the options and click on the option download and install. This will completely install the drivers of your unknown device in your windows 10 or windows 11. If this method doesn't work out, let's proceed with the second step. Right click on your start menu and choose the option device manager over here. Over here, whatever driver is not installing in your system, you must be getting a yellow exclamatory sign like it is present right over here. Basically, you need to right click on it and choose the option disable device. Hit the yes button. Once disabled, again right click and enable the device. This simple fix sometimes fix out the issue of device driver software was not installed in your system. If this doesn't fix, let's proceed with the next step right in the device manager itself. You need to right click on it and choose the option update driver. Choose the second option browse my computer for drivers and again choose second option which is let me pick from the list of available drivers. So the list of drivers are available that are present in your system. So depending upon the hardware you have, if you have a Bluetooth, you have a batteries, if you have a computer or if you have any disk drive, you need to choose that particular option. I'll take an example of Bluetooth over here. Select the Bluetooth device and hit the next button and hit the list of Bluetooth manufacturers available right in front of you. From here, you need to find your Bluetooth manufacturer if it is Intel, Microsoft, Realtek or any Bluetooth manufacturer, simply select the manufacturer and click on the driver and hit the next button to continue installing the drivers and this will fix out the issue of device driver software was not successfully installed. If this method also fails, in next step, you need to open your web browser and here in the address bar directly, you need to type the name of your Bluetooth manufacturer. For example, in device manager, I, I have known that my Bluetooth manufacturer is Intel dual band wireless AC7265. So I'll type here Intel dual band wireless AC7265 driver and then hit the enter button. As the manufacturer is my Intel, so you need to click on the Intel website which is the very first link. Click on the link, scroll down and click on the option of the drivers present over here. Click on the view details, scroll down and you will find the driver for Windows 10 64 bit or 32 bit. Click on the download option, accept the terms and conditions and it will start it to download. Once these drivers are downloaded, go ahead and double click to install this particular driver in your system and this will fix out the issue of device driver software was not successfully installed. However, if you do not want to go the, all this process and you want to update your driver automatically without any effort, I have a video with update drivers for Windows 10 or Windows 11 right over here. You can simply watch this particular tutorial. It hardly takes you more than 2 to 3 minutes. Watch this complete tutorial and this video will help you to fix out the issue of device driver software was not successfully installed by installing the drivers of your required hardware. So this is all about it friends. This is how you can fix the issue of your device driver software was not successfully installed. If you are new to this channel and have not subscribed yet, I request you to please click on the subscribe button and click on the bell notification icon to continue receiving updates from my channel.